Mate, you look rough. It's not even funny. Where did you even go? You just disappeared. <laughs> Fuck knows. Did a Houdini. Just ran off. Again. I woke up on Brad's mum's floor this morning. Eh? You what? Completely naked apart from a rubber ring. You fucking... You joking? I'm not. <laughs> Was Brad even there? I don't know. A rubber ring? A rubber ring. <laughs> a inflatable rubber ring. Fuck. I was on the shop floor this morning, right, on air, uh, frozen, and a Karen comes up to me asking why there's no Von Events left. At 10.05, Von Events just wasn't in the mood. No, right, and, and, I, and I felt this, um, this no. kind of... No, 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 yeah. you didn't. I felt the bile rising up my throat. No, nah, I'm not, I can't, oh God. I was like, I'm so sorry, love. There isn't any left. Let me go check at the back for you. No, oh, no. And I was walking, I just knew. I just fucking knew it was. <laughs> I vomed all over the road. <laughs> no, you did not. Is that why it's cornered off? Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> did you see his mum this morning? No. Nah. I woke up before anyone. The front door was locked, so I had to climb out, out the uh, kitchen window. I jumped the back wall into the alley. Naked? No, no. I found my clothes. I think they were mine. I ordered an Uber on 1%. Brad's going to be pissed off sleeping on his mum's floor again. Well, it's not my fault. I had nowhere really else to go. Are you going to speak to them? Nah. Something really to speak about. You've got to do something. You can't keep showering here and sleeping in your car. I've not really got a choice, have I? You can come stay at mine if you want. I've only got a couch. Really? Yeah, of course. It's no bother. That means a lot, actually. Thanks. Are you gonna... Yeah. <laughs>